My, uh, how did your SAT go? I got a four. You got a 400? No, no, a four. Well, good job, I guess. Seniors, if you would like to speak at graduation, please fill out the Google form that was sent to your school email. You will need to submit a copy of your speech that should be no longer than three to four minutes. Deadline is March 3rd. Please email Mr. Giordano if you have any questions. The NHS Counseling Department and the Noblesville Schools Education Foundation have released this year's list of local scholarships on the NHS Counseling 2022-2023 Canvas page. If you have any questions, please reach out to your guidance counselor. Millstream Issue 4, Living a Double Life, is out now. Pick up a copy in the podiums around the school or in your English classrooms to get an inside look on how bilingual students keep in touch with their culture while also maintaining a school life. A new Around the County episode is out now. Check out NHS News on YouTube to learn all about the unique guitar program offered here at NHS. And explore how Noblesville High School has changed since its opening. Now let's hop over to Trending Today. The Mandalorian Season 3 is out today for all of you Star Wars fans, as well as for all of you people who just watch the show but don't know anything about Star Wars. This season will be eight episodes long with a premiere that is only 35 minutes long. Wow, that runtime is absolutely devastating. But back over to meetings. The 3v3 co-ed basketball tournament is during AL. The championship will be played on March 10th during AL, followed by a student versus faculty game. News was superb today. Just like my SAT score. Sure, buddy. Let's go to sports. I'm Hannah Rapti, and you're watching Theater Thursday. Ms. Packard opens in one week. Tickets are on sale, and you can find them either at nhstheater.wibbly.com or at nhstheater.ludus.com. Follow us at Packard 23 on Instagram for some great behind-the-scenes pictures and information on the upcoming show. Have a great day, NHS. This is how you're staying organized? Yeah, sure. So are you interested in a study skills group? Well, if you're interested, starting in ALs on March 6th, we're going to start talking about smart goals, planning, color coding, note-taking, and a lot of other really cool topics. And um, I think, Mr. Spinner, I think you could benefit from it. We request an e-hall pass and we get approved, we can be one of the few lucky 35 students that's part of the study skills group. Okay. Let's do it. Uh, here it is. There's the note. See you on March 6th. Hey, 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 Millers. Bro really thinks he's Jack Dugani. For sure. Sport time with Mr. Sport. The boys' swim team finished out their season strong with a 14th place finish at the IHSAA state meet. This placing ties the highest placing ever at the state meet in Miller history. Sophomore Aiden Kless placed fifth in the state for one meter diving, and senior Aiden Bettel led the Millers with a third place finish in the 100 breaststroke, re-breaking the school record for the event. Great job, boys. Your girls' gymnastics team competed at the Lafayette Jefferson sectional this past weekend, with two Millers competing. Freshman Kylie Lotridge placed an all-around score of 28, 0.475, while junior Elena Lotridge posted a 26.35. Good job, ladies. March is here. You know what that means? March Madness is right around the corner. This past weekend provided a sample of what March is going to be like with six game-tying or game-wizzing buzzer beaters, including a half-court shot to beat their crosstown rival, or a turnaround three to send the game to overtime. Looks like March is going to be just as great. Now after sports this week. The boys' basketball IHSAA sectional semifinal will take place at Carmel High School at 6 p.m. on Friday. We will play the winner of the Carmel and Westfield game. Millers, pack the house. Maya, I'm really sorry for interrupting Kylie you. It'll never happen again. It's okay, Gabriel. I forgive, but I do not forget. Sleep tight, Millers. Mm -hmm.